Hey guys, it's your girl Missy coming back at you again with another Dollar Tree haul for you all. So I know it's been about two months since I have posted a Dollar Tree haul, but you guys are just in luck because I have an abundance of items here to show you guys from the Dollar Tree. Also stay tuned to the end of this video because I will be doing a giveaway and I will let you guys know how to be entered into that at the end. So I hope you guys enjoy this Dollar Tree haul. All right, so I've noticed a lot of Dollar Tree haulers hauling really awesome products from the brand Elf, and I was really excited when I noticed that there was Elf at my local Dollar Tree and there was an abundance of it. So I snagged one of everything, and I'm just really excited because I love Elf. So let's go ahead and get started into the makeup item of this Dollar Tree haul or the makeup portion. So the first thing I got is this lip lacquer. I always keep wanting to call it nail lacquer, but it's a lip lacquer in the color of natural, which is just a kind of like a nice little nude color. Um, it looks a little bit more brown in the sliding, but it's not. It's more of like a naturally nude color. The next item I got is this shimmer lip gloss in the color of Inspire. And it's just kind of a really pretty pink shimmery color. So I'm excited to try that out. The next item I got is this blush actually in the color of Glow. And I, it has a lot of shimmering uh, shimmers to it. So shimmering shimmers, shimmering shimmers, wow. Wow, Missy. Okay, so it has a lot of shimmer to it. So I think this will actually be a really pretty blush as well as kind of like a little highlighter as well. Uh, the next thing I got was blush as well. And this is in the black box. Now, the other things that I showed you guys usually are only like the dollar products. And these are the $3 products with it coming in the black box. But this is another blush in the color of Twinkle Pink. And I didn't open this one. It hasn't been opened, but hopefully it's good. The next thing I have is another lipstick. This is a lipstick and not a lip lacquer, but this is in the color of Posh, and it's more like a really pretty wine, ready purple color. So I'm really excited to try that one out. The next e.l.f. product I have actually is another moisturizing lipstick in a black box, and the color is Wine Tour. Now this looks like a very, very dark Merlot color, and I'm really excited for that. Um, the next item, which I'm gonna set that Merlot one off to the side because I have something to show you guys with that. Uh, the next thing I got is a lip stain and this is in the color of Petal Pink. And I really am excited to try this out. It looks like it's almost just got a marker tip to it. So hopefully that'll, that'll be good. And the last e.l.f. product that I have is just this angled blush brush. Now you can never go wrong. I always use tons of different brushes, so I actually snagged myself quite a few of these to use with other products. And the reason I held on to this wine tour lipstick is in the color of Merlot because I got this from Diamond Cosmetics and it is in the color of Merlot as well. And it says it's an eyeliner, but I'm gonna be using these two paired together since this is more of a Merlot color and this is the color of Merlot. So I got this to go with that, okay. So that's the only thing I have from e.l.f. And then I'm gonna move over onto the beauty benefits. Now, when I was looking at the beauty benefits little display that was there, there were a lot of colors that were not my shades. So I just picked up two items that I thought I would actually be able to use. Um, the first thing I picked up was this eyeshadow trio from beauty benefits and it's in the color of, I wanna say this is, one is earth, but Yes, it is. It's in the color of Earth. So it's just an eyeshadow trio. I apologize for the glare, but it's in just like a nice brown, dark brown, light brown, and like a medium brown color. Both, all three of those are gorgeous. And then last but not least from Beauty Benefits is I got this flamingo color blush. So in the in here, it looks a little red and tangerine-y, but it actually is kind of like a orangey pink color. So I'm kind of excited to try that out. I'm trying to go out of the realm of wearing just fuchsia blush. Right now I'm wearing one from Tarte Cosmetics um, and it is a little more terracotta color and I'm really digging it. It really is warming up my face. So, and let's see, they have two of the last two items I have for the face and the beauty are from this, one of them's from Global Beauty Care and these are the collagen masks. And the next one is from Rich Radiance, and this is a cocoa and shea butter treatment mask. So it comes with two in each box. So I'm excited to try those out. I did try one from this with the retinol, and it was an okay product. Um, I still have one left. So yeah, still have one of those left. All right, let's go over into uh, 
let's go over into like the kids toy stuff see i've got i've got tons of stuff and this is where it gets kind of hectic because i've got a box over here i got stuff over here on my desk so yeah all right so let's go into the kids items so mechano is a brand that makes mechanoids and the only reason i know this is because my niece really wanted one for christmas a couple years ago and so i got her a mechanoid robot and all it is is just little pieces that you put together and you can make a robot out of it but i was really pleasantly surprised to see these actually at my dollar tree store because of the fact they are a name brand item so this is bolt from the makers of mechano and they also, like I said, make the mechanoid toys. And so I got these for my nephew because he's really, really into putting things together. Like he is a master at Legos at six years old. Um, so he's, he's a champion. So he saw these and he actually was the one that pointed them out and said that he wanted them. So I'm like, well, give them to me and Aunt Missy will buy them for you for Christmas and just put them in his stocking. So we ended up getting this one, which is the biplane. We got this one, which is the helicopter. We got this one, which just is a regular plane. We got this one, which is the race car. And last but not least, we got this one, which I thought was super cute, which is a bulldozer. So all of those, I got him to just kind of shove in his stocking. I think he's really gonna like them, especially since he's the one that pointed them out. All right, so let's go over into kind of like arts and crafts area. Now I've hauled these before and I, I like them a lot. Um, but they actually ended up coming up with or coming out with different ones. So this is from Ready Set Stamp. It's stamps that you can make on your own, one, two, three, and they give you actually the steps to do it. So the first step is this: you get a Ready Set Stamp block, and it's just a little uh, clear plastic block, and it's gridded, so you can actually put the stamps on it in the right order or where you want them to be, so you can measure it out perfectly. So that's step number one. Step number two is the actual stamps itself. I know that there's a company called Stamp It Up and they actually kind of have the same sort of thing, I believe. Um, but this one came and this is kind of like the hello, just a note, little bubbles. The second one I got were the letters. And the third one I got, which was my favorite, is the desserts and the sweets. And at the bottom, that one says, you're so sweet. And then I also got the stamps, and I believe this is in black and blue. I know that's gonna be hard for you guys to see. This is the blue one, this is the black one. So I got those because I like them and I think they're adorable. And I know some people that I can give those to if I don't end up using them and they will love them as well. Okay, and then also I got this because I've mentioned before several times in my other videos at work, we do this thing called Terry's Craft Corner and we craft and we always use Mod Podge. So I thought this was just cute to kind of have my own because Mod Podge is pretty expensive. So I got this at the dollar store and this is in the matte finish. Okay, and then let's go to these. I saw these actually as I was checking out and I thought that these were pretty cool. So these are called Get Fit Cards. Now this one is for adults, this one is for children. And basically you don't have to like, it's just, it's super simple. It comes with little dice that you put together. You roll the dice, you get the picture or the color of the card and you do that workout. So the only reason I picked these up was to include these into the giveaway since New Year's is right around the corner and I know that everybody has resolutions. So why not? If you decide to get fit, have your kids get fit and have fun with your children. So that's actually going in the giveaway stuff. Okay. I also decided to pick up new stockings for my children. And as we all know, I have a hairless cat. His name is Tucker. I know this one isn't hairless, but this is his little kitty cat stocking. And then I got these cute little puppy dog ones. These look nothing like Daisy or Bruiser, but it's okay. It'll work for now. So I picked up those for them. And let me go grab my other box of things because we're only halfway through. All right, so let's continue on. The next item I have to show you guys are these, I thought they were hilarious, but they are called beer bands. And they look like this, and they actually come in multicolors. One says chatty, quirky, clumsy, adventurous, emotional, and cheerful. And my assumption for these are when you start drinking, everybody has an emotion that comes out when they start drinking. And so I just thought these were really funny to just have around the house. Okay, the next items that I have to show you guys, it might get a little loud, so I apologize, are these kitchen utensils. Whoops. 
I just dropped one, are these kitchen utensils. Now, there are six pieces, I believe. Yes, six pieces. And it comes with a ladle. They had a ladle, a potato masher, a regular spoon, a slotted spoon, a regular spatula, and a slotted spatula. But the reason I like these is because the handle is done in this like really pretty gold color. And so I really, really like that. Also, what had the matching set, this is gonna get loud, sorry. I always drop everything. So it also came matching with all of these items are a mixing bowl that's in a gold color, silver on the inside. And then these really awesome mugs that almost remind me of the mugs that you put, um, is it, what is it? A Moscow Mule? Is that what it is? I think so, I could be wrong. Um, but just like the little copper cups, even though I don't, this isn't, this isn't copper, but it just has this really pretty copper color on the outside and then just silver on the inside. And I ended up picking up a couple of those as well. I'm going to try to toss those so they don't make noise. All right. The next little kitchen, kitchen item that I have were these. Now I was really like pleasantly surprised that I actually saw these at the Dollar Tree. Again, another name brand thing at the Dollar Tree. But this is from the company Aladdin, which I know they sell Aladdin at Walmart as well as Shopco, I believe. But this is just a tumbler mason jar. And I thought this was so super cute. I got one of these for a girl that I work with because she is totally into mason jars. The next thing I got were these Aladdin lids. And these are drink through mason lids. So what you do is you just take the mason lid shove it inside the mason jar and it creates a sippy cup, an adult sippy cup, if you will, for your, for your mason jars. So I picked those up in red, till, purple, and green. I like that. All right. And then this is just kind of other fun stocking stuffer things. As you can tell, um, I like things that are fluffy and furry as of late. And so I found this little beanie that has a poof ball at the top of it just for myself for winter. Then another thing I got is this from E-Circuit. It's a six in one stylus pen. I got this for Ashton just because I thought it would be cool. And it comes with a pen, a stylus, a leveler, a ruler, and a flathead and a Phillips head screwdriver. So I thought that was pretty neat. I also picked up this emergency flashlight. Now these are actually really, really cool. And I'll show you guys, you just kind of unlock the back and it comes with this little pump. So you pump it and then you can turn it on. Now this is really awesome because they do not require batteries at all. So it's great for any emergency situation. And I actually ended up picking up these for every man in my family for a stocking stuffer or whatever for Christmas. I also picked up this, which is a angle square for Ashton. And I also, I also picked one of these up for myself. Um, this is just really good to have to make those nice square clean measurements and it is metal. So that's a really good deal for a buck. And last but not least is a sequin changing. I know these things are like super hip and popular where the sequins can change. Ooh, they're so fun. But I actually ended up getting this for another girl that I work with because she loves things like this. So that's the only thing I have to show you guys for this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Now let's go ahead and talk about the giveaway. So mystery boxes that are getting purchased on eBay are like running rampant through YouTube. Everybody is buying these mystery boxes. So I'm actually not going to purchase anything for a mystery box, but what I'm going to do is I am going to be giving away mystery boxes. Now these items or mystery bags, I should say, not a mystery box, mystery bags. So these items are that are gonna be in the mystery bags are gonna be things that I have purchased from the dollar store or wish.com or AliExpress. And it's going to be things that I bought that I thought I was gonna use and never did. It's gonna be things that I bought way too many of, or it's gonna be things that I bought that I just thought were cool at the time. And then looking at it, I was like, eh, well, I'm probably not gonna use this. So. I have a huge box sitting over here. You already saw two items that went into that box, but there is a bunch of items in there. So what I'm going to be doing is shoving bags full of items, sealing them, and then giving them away. So I don't even know how many bags I'm going to have, but I'm pretty sure there's going to be at least four, at least four bags. So 
All you guys have to do to get entered into this giveaway is like up this video, subscribe to my channel and comment blue hearts down in the comment box below. So then next Saturday, I'm going to be posting another video of all the people that won the mystery bags. And I hope you guys are super excited because I'm super excited to be giving it away. But yeah, so that's just simply it. That's all you guys have to do. So if you guys like this video, if you guys want to be entered into this giveaway, again, all you have to do is give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel because it is free and comment those blue hearts. That's all you guys got to do. And until next time, see ya.